As Dr. Rahani said, my name is Steve Avedessa. I'm the lab manager here. So you've seen a lot of cool projects now, okay? But all those parts have to come from somewhere. And this is where the magic happens, folks. So let's take a walk around and see, you know, what facilities are available to you when you come here to UMA. So in this corner over here, we have both MIG and TIG welding available to the students after appropriate training. We can do both steel and aluminum. We've got a very nice four axis milling machine over here. This is our tour mock. And we'll go down the other way, excuse me. So I know you're dying to know what these two items are, but we're gonna hold that until the end. So if you come this way, we have our lathe, very nice unit, two bridge boards that are available for student use. And I bet some of you guys like 3D printing. Okay, who doesn't like 3D printing? This is a monster 3D printer. This was a gift from Jackson Labs. And we are getting this fired up and commissioned. So this will be available to the students as well. Okay, so let's go back. Let's take a look at some of these other projects that we've got going on. This, believe it or not, is not an afterburning snowmobile. We took a 2006 Arctic Cat, we ripped the back seat off, and we installed 3,000 PSI natural gas. This is an exceptionally burning, exceptionally clean burning sled. This produces about 1% of the pollution of a standard sled. So uh, we took this to Detroit. We have gotten competition wins with this. Very nice project that we did for a number of years. Up above, folks, this is our human-powered submarine. So that kind of gives you an idea of the range of projects we do here at UMA. We do everything from this, wide carriage CNC router. This was actually student built. This was a capstone project one year. The students had to do all the background work. They had to CAD this entire thing up in solid works. And then they came in and built it. And it actually runs exceptionally well. So I hope that you will you know, like what you see here. And I hope you'll join us here at UMA.